Social Security will be getting $200 boost in September 2024. Social Security New Bill Update for SSI SSDI VA The cost of living adjustment, COLA, is an annual increase made to Social Security and Supplemental Security Income, SSI, benefits to account for inflation. Each year, the Social Security Administration analyzes consumer price data to determine the COLA percentage that will take effect in January. With inflation still impacting living costs, many retirees and beneficiaries are curious about what the 2025 COLA might look like. Based on current economic projections, most analysts are estimating a 2025 COLA somewhere between 2.4% to 3.2%, with an average projection of 2.8%. This estimate accounts for signs that inflation is beginning to cool down from the high rates seen over the past year. The Federal Reserve has been aggressively raising interest rates in 2022 in an attempt to bring inflation back down to its 2% target range. If successful, that would likely result in a COLA near the lower end of estimates. However, inflation has proved stubborn, so the final figure could come in higher depending on future price increases. To put the estimated 2.8% COLA increase into perspective, someone currently receiving $1,000 per month in Social Security benefits could expect to see an additional $28 added to their monthly payment starting in January 2025. For the average retired worker now getting $1,997 per month, a 2.8% COLA would equate to an extra $53. While any increase helps, it's important to note that a COLA of this size may not fully offset rising costs that beneficiaries face. Expenses like health care, housing, food, and energy have been climbing at rates higher than the general inflation level factored into the COLA calculation. When weighing the projected COLA, it's also necessary to consider legislative and programmatic factors that could impact the future of Social Security benefits. Two bills have been proposed in Congress, the Social Security Expansion Act and the Social Security 2100 Act, which address issues like benefit calculation changes and modifications to the COLA formula. However, passing such wide-ranging reforms will be an uphill battle. On the funding side, the latest projections indicate the Social Security Trust Funds could be depleted by 2035 if no action is taken. Lawmakers will face mounting pressure to find solutions that strengthen the program's long-term fiscal health, whether that involves further raising the payroll tax income limit, increasing the full retirement age, or other adjustments. Regardless of the final 2025 COLA percentage, beneficiaries have options for maximizing their benefits within the existing Social Security system. Delaying the start of claiming as long as possible up until age 70 results in higher monthly payments. Working while receiving early retirement benefits allows for earnings without losing Social Security income. Married couples should explore optimizing benefits based on each spouse's work history through spousal, survivor, or divorce claiming strategies. Staying on top of annual COLA updates and potential legislative changes will help beneficiaries plan budgets and lifestyles in retirement, but proactively taking steps earlier in the claiming process presents the best opportunities to boost guaranteed lifetime income from Social Security. With prudent planning and decision-making, these adjustments can make the program more financially sustainable and better meet the needs of an aging population for decades to come. Retirees would be wise to regularly reevaluate their specific situations and explore all available options. Doing so will equip them to get the most from this foundation of retirement security through changing economic conditions. Early estimates for the 2025 Social Security COLA point to a potential increase around 2.8% based on current inflation trends. While providing some additional purchasing power, a COLA of this size likely won't fully offset higher living costs faced by many beneficiaries. The longer-term outlook also hinges on unresolved issues concerning program funding, proposed legislative reforms, and demographic challenges but maximizing benefits through delayed claiming, working restrictions, and targeted strategies offers retirees greater control over optimizing their guaranteed Social Security income. Staying informed about updates and actively managing benefits positions individuals to better weather uncertainty and navigate obstacles to maintaining standard of living in their senior years. Beyond just the annual COLA, other factors influence how far retirement benefits can stretch. Healthcare costs are a prime example, as medical expenses tend to rise faster than inflation each year. 
Currently, the average retired couple will need about $300,000 saved just to cover health care and medical costs in retirement, according to estimates. For those relying solely on Social Security, these expenses loom large. Some options to help bridge the gap include Medicare Advantage plans. These are private insurance alternatives to traditional Medicare that often provide extra benefits. However, not all doctors accept them, which limits choice. Medigap supplemental policies, available to those enrolled in regular Medicare. These help cover deductibles, co-pays, and some services original Medicare doesn't. Premiums can be significant, though. Health savings accounts. For those still working, an HSA allows tax-free savings for future medical costs in retirement if used appropriately. But not everyone has access through an employer. Long-term care insurance, with many unable to self-fund extended nursing home care, LTCI protects against these catastrophic costs if purchased early enough at reasonable premiums. Not all applicants qualify medically, however. Prescription assistance, programs from pharmaceutical companies, charities and states may help cover medication costs for qualified low-income seniors. Resources and qualifications vary greatly. While healthcare poses a major challenge, housing is another large and sometimes variable expense. For homeowners, paying off a mortgage before retiring removes a significant monthly liability. Another approach gaining traction is reverse mortgages, which allow extracting equity from a paid-off home as tax-free income without needing to sell. Unlike a traditional second mortgage, no repayment is required with a reverse mortgage. But fees are involved, the balance still comes due either upon passing or vacating the property, and Medicaid eligibility could be impacted. Renters have less flexibility, so researching subsidized senior housing and rent control laws is prudent. Multi-generational households may also help share housing costs amongst family members. Transportation and communication costs must also factor into retirement budgets. Consider relocating to an area with lower living expenses and better public transit access if driving becomes difficult. Talking to family about ride assistance needs. Researching discounted or subsidized services for seniors. Leveraging technology can also save, like free calling apps in place of traditional phone bills. Food costs may seem minor, but dining choices impact health and budget. Meal kit delivery programs cut grocery bills versus dining out. Community centers, food banks, and subsidized meal programs help those in need. But nutrition is important for quality of life. A balanced approach is best. Similarly, remaining socially engaged helps well-being and combats isolation, which can lead to additional health issues. Of course, not all rising expenses can be planned for or avoided. That's why it remains crucial for future retirees to save outside of Social Security whenever possible through workplace retirement plans, IRAs, and general savings. The earlier these supplementary funds are accumulated, the longer they have to potentially grow. While not mandatory, saving even $100 per month from ages 25 to 67 could result in over $250,000 with average market returns. No one has a crystal ball to predict future COLAs, inflation rates, health costs, tax laws, or investment returns. 